Hi there, this is my lot. And uh, as you can guess from the thumbnail, this is my entry video into the, the Jack Fox mini lot giveaway. Now, Jack has asked us to uh, to pick our smallest lock while we uh, while we talk a little bit about ourselves. So I will pick this little Abus sixty five fifteen, and if we compare it to this this Master Lock number nineteen, the uh, the shackle on the Master Lock is almost as th as thick as this uh, little Abus is wide. So. Uh, yeah, so what can I say about myself? This is uh, difficult. I'm not very good at this sort of thing. Um, well, one of my uh, one of my other hobbies, uh, my well, previous hobbies, was photography. I used to quite like um, doing macro photography. I had a, a Canon seven D, um, and then I I ended up with a five D Mark three, and used to do. Uh, close-up macro f uh, photographs of bugs and insects and, and that sort of thing. Um, it, I used to I used to take the dog out for a walk and while I was walking the dog I would take a few photos and, and whatnot but when the dog passed away I, I kind of lost my mojo for it so um, I've not really done much photography in quite some time. Uh, now, just after I lost my uh, my dog, um, I I ended up going into shielding because of the lockdown. I've got a an autoimmune disease that that kind of destroys my lungs. Um, it, it's it's a weird one. It's it's a rare the uh, smoking related. Uh, which I don't do anymore. And uh, if any of you guys smoke out there, you know, the, this disease is, it affects like one in 500,000 people. And uh, as long as those odds are, it can happen to you. It happened to me. And uh, I mean, it, it could have been worse. It could have been lung cancer. Um you know, it's yeah, just I I'd been trying to give up smoking for quite some time, but nothing galvanizes your determination more than having a medical specialist sitting on the other side of a desk after going through all these medical uh, tests and scans and procedures, um, and then basically telling you if you don't stop smoking, you will die, and. Yeah, within within a fortnight of being told that I had uh, I had given up the cigarettes. So we click from two, a little click from one. We are open. Uh, so yeah, I mean I I gave up the cigarettes. I cold turkey, um, cigarettes, and I used to smoke copious amounts of the uh, marijuana as well. Uh, knocked it all in the head, cold turkey. Um, as I was as I was giving up, I I would leave my tobacco tin, um, and all my paraphernalia, on my desk. And uh, after about three or four months, I I just threw the whole lot in the bin. Um, job done. Never looked back. Never felt well. Never felt better. And it's a. Uh, it's one of the very few truly worth worthwhile things I've ever I've ever done was uh, giving up that smoking. Uh, anyway, so lockdown happened. Um, you know, I wasn't out much because I was shielding. Um, decided I I needed a a new hobby, and along came lock picking, and uh, I used to watch Bosnian Bill quite a lot. But you know, before I had to set lock picks or anything like that. And then eventually I ordered myself a set of uh, Southord, I think it was the C1510, um, I think it was a 15 piece Euro, Euro slim, Euro profiles sort of uh, lock picks from Southord. 
I've used them for quite a while and then decided I was probably going to stick at the hobby for quite a while so I I uh, invested, saved up and invested uh, in a set of law lock tools um, I think it was the, the Renegade Pro kit um, oh, Sorry for your ears if you're wearing uh, headsets but yeah, Red Renegade Pro set uh, with some, some extras. I keep my spears, some of my spears in here. Um, that's <laughs> we all know what this hobby can can become like. You know, I've also got the uh, I've also got these that I use quite a lot, and yeah, I mean, it, it gets out of hand. It gets out of hand, doesn't it? Anyway, that's that's my entry. Uh, into the, the mini lock giveaway good luck to everybody and uh, yeah thanks for watching have a good one cheers